subscription spa. We are having a look at the subscription box from the folks over at Geek Fuel for the month of May. Geek Fuel is your one-step destination if you want to have monthly boxes delivered to your door that contain geek-tastic things inside. Fuel your geek with Geek Fuel. Good size box as well, I have to say, for this month. Hopefully that equals some really good goodies inside. So, without further ado, let's grab ourselves a knife. I got old right here. Let's get the tape cut on the front. Get the tape cut on the sides. And that would allow me to get to the contents inside the box. We open up the box flap. Geeky goodness inside. Usually yes is always the case. We got some tissue paper. Just get the tissue paper opened up. And we'll just kind of lay it on the side like we just open up a package of deli meat. First things first, we have ourselves a poster or something rolled up in a tube. I don't think it would be a pair of shoes. I'm willing to guess it's also not a t-shirt. And I'm also willing to bet I can't get it out. Oh, it's actually open on both sides. Oh, look at me, I'm such a stupid idiot. Pull up the tube. Try not to rip it, oh boy. It's a good way to start where you can't even open up the blasted tube of whatever it is inside. Ugh, there we go. Just I had a little corner of the paper stuck. I hate when that happens. All right, so first thing, oh, look at this. We've got Yoda. Now that looks like Yoda. I'm trying to look at the design. I'm trying to think of what design that would be. Kind of looks like maybe something from maybe Kid Robot. I'm sure it'll come to me later. That's neat, a little black and white print of Yoda. Hang on the wall, I will. Yes! Next thing, we have the Geek Fuel magazine, which we'll look at in a second, because we don't want to ruin that. We've got, oh, look at this. Plants vs. Zombies 2, collect them all. It's about time, enamel pins. This comes to us from the folks over at, well, it says pvzstore.com. Doesn't actually say, I guess they are the makers of it. Let's get this opened up. Why not? It's here, isn't it? Let's open it up and find out. Let's find out more about these enamel pins. Series one, open up the first bag. Wow, that's, that's actually a good quality pin. Look at that. It is metal. It's got the easy to take off pin. I like that quite a bit. Got the little coconut cannonball. That's a good quality pin. That would be the kind of thing I would buy just on its own. I would, but we got it free, so I like that. We have uh, a pirate zombie. Again, that metal. I don't know why this all, all of a sudden is the, yes, it is metal. See, I'm tapping it. It could have been made out of cake. I could just do the exact same thing. It's uh, it's contoured too. Like it, it looks like it's been cast in the metal, and then, of course, the ink has been filled in in all those grooves. So the areas that are outlines are all kind of a little more raised than everything else. Let's open up the next one. Let's put this poster out of the way. This poster is kind of throwing me off for the proportions of where the backdrop or lot, uh, sit. Bok choy. Bonk choy. Kablamo. That's a little bit bigger than the others. Even when I put them together, you can feel how they're, well, you can hear how they are all metal. Next we have, finally, I should say we have, oops, that's upside down. Oops, and I just dropped it. Oh, Butterfingers. Butterfingers, I just dropped it. There we go. It's because it was upside down. I can't seem to hold it. It might as well be made out of butter. Seagull carrying one of the pirate zombies. Very cool. Little metal pins. I'm gonna definitely be putting those somewhere. I'm not sure where, but I'll be putting them somewhere. Square Heroes downloadable game code. Ten dollar value from Steam. Yeah, you know what? Why don't we do it? There you go. There you go, guys. There's the the code. You're welcome. Download a copy of Square Heroes on Steam. My gift to you or to whoever gets to jump on it right now. Everybody. It's funny that I could probably look at the time that this video drops on views maybe 
it's right at this time. Somebody, everybody is dashing to get this, to get their downloadable code. What do we got here? It's Geek Fuel. Oh, is it a Geek Fuel? It is Geek Fuel little sweatband. At least I think that's what it is. I kind of took the properties of what the the wrist watches or the slap bracelets used to be, and I gauged the fact that it was a little bit wider. So my thought was, if you follow along with me, my thought was this is a sweatband, and that is what I think it is. Fits actually my arm quite well. I've got small arms, so it benefits me. All right, so what else we have here? We got a comic, Secret Wars 0001. Actually, that's three zeros, two zeros, two zeros and one. Secret Wars one, variant edition. I would like the artwork on the front. Not keen on Spider-Man's artwork, but I do like the artwork on everybody else. Oh. Oh, excuse me. Certificate of Authenticity. Dynamic Forces Inc. has issued this certificate to authenticate this copy of Secret Wars Number 1 Dynamic Forces exclusive cover as one of a specially limited series of 1,500 copies. 1,500 copies. That's it. Nice. I'm going to put that to the side. I don't even want to open that then. And of course, of course, we have ourselves a t-shirt. The t-shirt is, yes, good size. We got Weeping Angels. See that right there? Weeping Angels. I tell you, one thing about getting these subscription boxes every month is that my collection of t-shirts grows very large, very fast. That's one good thing about collecting t-shirts. Uh, yeah, we had a pretty good haul all around. And of course, now that we've done that, let's have a look at our Geek Fuel magazine. The Miserable World of the Terrible Odd. 10 tips to woo a Wookie. Wookie? I don't know why I said Wookie. And don't miss the Blink Tour, nine most anticipated films of the year. Uh, Movie Geek Out Tomorrowland, which sadly bombed. Fantastic Four, Mad Max, Ted 2, Deadpool, Apocalypse, X-Men Apocalypse, Doctor Strange, Suicide Squad, and The Sinister Six. I guess some of these probably were printed before because obviously Tomorrowland didn't do very well. And uh, Sinister Six, I don't think is even happening anymore. Or maybe it is. I don't think it is. I'm going to say it's not. Some nice t-shirts inside. Oh, okay. This was the individual that made our Yoda. Uh, terribly odd. Must find himself uncomfortably surrounded at times. Raised in the warm waters of the Atlantic, he began schooling at the... Savannah College of Art and Design. Discovering that fine art came with a price, he left the school and the cutthroat egotistic atmosphere it encapsulated. Thinking graphic design would be a better fit, he made the transition and began laying the framework of the art he produces today. Some of these prints, even like the Yoda, I, I wish it was on a t-shirt. I mean, I like the, the Weeping Angels, but I totally would have gone with that Yoda on that t-shirt. I really like his artwork. Uh, the coolest con you'll probably never get to attend, Los Angeles Convention Center. Gotta get out to these conventions. Rebels Revealed, the droid you're looking for. And then we've got some Weeping Angels Don't Blink Tour. Some people showing off their nerd boxes. Like that. And Square Heroes about the game that I have offered to you my gift to you and what else we have here and some ultimate geek guide brotherhood of steel salvation hoodie oh that looks nice store bethsoft.com amulet of mara messenger bag a pretty good haul let me say all around we got ourselves the t-shirts we got ourselves the limited edition comic I, I like that quite a bit the downloadable game which now is somebody's gift we got some pins Got a poster. We got ourselves a pretty good haul this month. If you guys would like to have Geek Fuel delivered to your door every single month like myself, you can click the link down below and subscribe to Geek Fuel today. Uh, we were today having a look at the Geek Fuel subscription box for the month of May. Thanks for watching as you always do, guys. And certainly stay tuned as we have a look at other things that can come to your door every single month. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.